what is going on my dudes welcome back to a brand new video today we have for you guys fifa 21 starter squads i will be showing you guys my squad as well that i plan on building with a thousand dollars put into the game first day so i'm really hoping that you know we get some good squads here uh if you guys want to be added to this make sure that you guys do go follow me on twitter because that's kind of like where i'm going to be posting more of this and i will also let you guys know in the youtube uh, tab it's just that i wanted to do this and just kind of bring out a video to you guys so i could show you some starter squads that you guys sent me so if you guys enjoy these type of videos, guys, as always, make sure you guys do like the video, sub to the channel, and comment down below, and let me know who you guys are planning on going for for a starter squad, how much you guys are spending, and uh, yeah, man, remember, like it for the YouTube algorithm. Now, let's go ahead and get into this. I am going to scroll all the way down because we do have some people that posted first, um, and that's basically what the video is going to be, guys, just me showing you some starter squads, telling you guys a little bit of what I think and what I don't think, or what, you know, what will potentially happen. Uh, I went for very cheap. So my man, Brian Anza, thank you for submitting your squad. First of all, man, this looks like a really decent team, man. Konate and Mukiele look like they're going to be very good cards. And then you go over to Lecomte as well as a goalkeeper. Good. He's got Rosulian, which Rosulian will be a little expensive because of his pace, etc. And then he's got Lala. I would recommend that you go with, uh, who was I looking at chat? He was the right back. I can't remember, but it was a right back. Uh, I think it was Mukiele. Wait. Oh, he has right back here. Never mind. So he can't use him there. I would honestly like switch him and him and kind of get that on full chemistry. Uh, looking into his C CM, CDMs, he's going to play in a 4 one 2 one 2 I'm assuming potentially a 4 3 3 He's got Sanchez, uh, Coughlin, and Fakir as well. Actually, no, he'll probably be playing a 4 2 3 one He's got Iconi, which I also was thinking about getting Iconi. And then Gamero and Machis. The team looks really good. Overall, that is going to be a super cheap team compared to a lot of the other ones that I've seen with no FIFA points spent. Second squad right here, we have a very nice team. He didn't say how much he was going to drop. He kind of just put his team there. Uh, Malqui is a very good option. Uh, Kimbepi looks really good. Diallo going for basically a league um back line right here. And then he's going to use Haps, which by the way, looks really nice with Promise, which Promise might be a little expensive. I do think he might be like around 20k because he's been very good at the beginning of previous FIFAs. And then Nevin Nears as well looks like a really solid card. Now over here, he's got Tonali and he's got Bonaventura as the CDMs, uh, Politano and Belotti. Uh, someone did say that you should try and use Rebic right here. Uh, yo, Anonymous, thank you for the 100 bits, man. I appreciate that. He did say that Rebic would be a better option. And I do agree. Rebic looks like a beast. However, he might be a little bit more expensive. But overall, this team looks really nice. And uh, the triangles and everything here, man. Mwah, beautiful next team this would be the second one up we got my boy Aguero's key he is always in the stream so i'm happy to check your team man all right he says he's gonna do a road to glory and he's gonna try and get this for the first week in league i will say this dembele will be very expensive as will opamecano klosterman and probably gulashi as well including hernandez so those four players alone will probably run you around 150 to 200k if we're being realistic so this is probably like a two to 300k team more or less depending on when you buy it but overall, man, I really like it. I really like Llorente. I think Llorente's car looks really nice this year. And uh, that Porto link right there, man, is actually solid. So those two players right here are literally insane. And uh, that might be a combo that I might try on my Road to Glory because I will be doing a Road to Glory for the YouTube. Uh, and then, of course, Rabiel looks really good. He will be a little expensive, hope maybe, as well. Uh, Fakir usually is okay at the beginning of the year. Williams, depending on the weak foot could be a really solid card but overall man super solid team definitely for a starter team i, I rate this at like a 7 out of 10 and very nice team and yeah dude looks like a really good team i don't want to face this in the weekend league i'm not gonna lie to you next team up we have this one right here the team looks very solid i'm not gonna lie the back line looks nice i will say the center backs look a little bit slow but considering it will be the first couple of weeks of fifa i think 70 pace will be very uh, it'll be okay because players have lost a lot of pace in general so i do think 68 70 pace will be very usable this year at the beginning of the year um now his two fullbacks are really nice looking at hernandez he will be expensive and i see that ibra link i will say i don't think ibra will be very usable but i know a lot of people just love using him right and uh that link to nine golden very nice i think nine will still be a very usable uh, uh, insane card this year now this will be going to barca but somebody said that he can use mazari so that's another option that he does have as the right back for promise or maybe the debris link i'm not really sure now looking at the attack the attack will be cheap everything looks very cheap but he also has good stats so you could definitely use that we got window as the striker 
And then we got Anthony as the right wing coming in. I saw promise link right there. That Anthony car looks really nice as well. So overall, I do give this team, I think, an 8 out of 10. Just kind of leave Ibra out because I, I do think that he's going to be very slow. But if you're going to use him because you love him, go ahead by all means, man. Let me know what you guys think of the squad. We got another team right here. This man said he's spending 1.5k of FIFA points, so he should be able to afford this team right here. The back line, guys, looks absolutely insane. Edmund Militao has very nice pace. So does Diego Carlos. Those are probably some of the center backs that I will be going for as well. Neto is going to be a cheap option as a goalkeeper. Then he's got Cancelo on the right back position with Tellez on the left back. Very nice team in general. Links up to both the Brazilians. Allen and Fred as CDMs is going to be very nice. Allen being in the Premier League is going to give a lot of links to a lot of new players. So overall, I really do rate that option. And Fred is always really nice at the beginning of the game. He has been for the past couple of, uh, for the past two Fivas, for me at least. So I rate that. Havertz coming in, Bale coming in, Richarlison and Neymar. That Neymar, man, looks so nice. I don't know what I want to do if I want to get Neymar or Mbappe. So let me know what you guys think. But overall, guys, this team is literally like a 9.5 out of 10. Like, that's a very good starting team to go with, especially for the amount of field points he's spending. Up next, we have another, uh, basically, Prem with a little bit of a La Liga side as well. Uh, the, for the most part, guys, this team looks very nice. Um, it's going to be very expensive. De Bruyne is going to be quite a pretty penny at the beginning of FIFA. Uh, Robertson, Gomez, and Lloris looks like a very good triangle. I would say stay clear of Laporte and go for, like, Ake or something because, honestly, Ake will probably play better because of the actual pace. Um, I think 63 pace is cutting it really you know, tight in terms of pace, uh, even for the beginning of the game. Um, the midfield looks good. Henderson and Valverde. However, we did point out right before we started recording this that Bell is at Spurs, so he doesn't get that green link to Valverde. So I would recommend you go for like Allen instead of Valverde and, and then go for like a right back from the Premier League. And then the team is pretty much set. Uh, Rashford will be expensive, man. So you're looking at about eight to 800K to like a million coins for this team. Overall though, nine out of 10, very nice team. You, my friend, are going to spend a lot of FIFA points, I think. Next team, my dudes, we got Vinicius Jr., Jesus, and Lucas up top. Very nice top, you know, in general. He also has Brandt, probably going to be as a cam in a 4-2-3-1. He's got Llorente and Zakaria as the CDMs, and then the back line looks very nice. He did say he plans on getting this in two to three weeks after the game is out, so I would recommend that you get the top three players, Jesus, Lucas, and Vinicius first, because those players will probably rise a lot, especially if any of them get, like, an inform. Then you're looking at, like, them rising even more because of supply and demand. So, overall, I love the team, man. I wouldn't change anything about it. The back line is great. The goalkeeper is fine. The fullbacks are great. The team is just good, man, you know? So, 8 out of 10, man. Very nice team. Next team, dudes. He said he's going for a Bundesliga, you know, starter team. Uh, that Sané will be expensive. I will say, dude, make Sané a uh, left mid and then make Bailly the left forward so your Sané is on full chemistry because obviously he's the better player. You want to get him on better cam. Um, overall, dude, very nice team. The back line looks completely solid. Davis would be a pretty penny. Obviously, Sonny would probably be like 200K, maybe more than that. Uh, and everything else, it looks really good, actually. So I really rate the team for a Bundesliga side. I think this would be a very good contender for, you know, foot champions, etc. So if you guys are looking to pick any of these teams up, man, these all these players right here are very meta, very meta in general. So I definitely give it a like an 8.5 out of 10 in general, man, especially for it being Bundesliga, dude. So, you know, good team, man. So here is going to be the last team that you guys submitted for the YouTube. And then I'm going to show you guys my main account that I plan on making. Here we go, man. McLovin, Ed, thank you for submitting the team. I love you, buddy. Uh, he is going to drop 24K FIFA points first day. And he plans on getting this team. I definitely think that this team is doable on the first day. Bergeron, and Jesus, and Lucas will probably be the most expensive out of all those. Uh, and and that, those are going to be pricey. So I definitely recommend you get Lucas, Jesus first. And then, you know, kind of go around and get everybody else. Maybe look at Gucci St. Maximin for the left wing spot if he's cheaper than Bergeron because of the rating. Uh, overall, attack looks really nice, man. You have your CDM, Sissoko, Jabamin. Very nice. Mount, depending on if you're playing 4 one 2 one 2 or 4 2 3 one he can play Cam and he can also play CM for the most part. Not the best defensive, but, you know, uh, Jabamin and Sissoko will get that covered. Uh, your back line, dude, with Tierney, Sanchez, Gomez, and Cancelo looks very meta, very nice. And then Schmeichel. Very nice, man. I definitely say this is an 8.5 out of 10 in terms of like a Prem team and just overall players, man. For 24K, make sure you get that team fast.
Alrighty, my dudes, we're gonna end up this video with the team that I want to make on my main account. I will be dropping probably a grand of FIFA points, maybe 1.5K until I get something similar to this. Now, the first player that I will be picking up is Mbappe, as you guys can see. It's either gonna be Mbappe or Neymar. So let me know who you guys would rather see me play with, Neymar or Mbappe. I doubt that I'll be able to afford both of them and be able to have a, uh, like a decent team all the way around. But this is kind of like what we decided in the Twitch chat. So make sure you guys go follow me at Twitch at twitch.tv for slash Ready Hugo. If you guys, you know, want to talk with me about this stuff live. So Mbappe, Yetter, Iconi will be the players that I will get from Ligue 1. We do have Hazard, Valverde. I think these two will be really, really good this year. We got Renan Lodi and we got Eder Militao as well. So I think this left side is honestly very meta and it will be super meta for this year. Uh, and that's what we have for right now. If I can afford to get Varane, I will probably get Varane right here. Now, going over here, we got, like I said, we have uh, Sissoko, Ake, and Cancelo from the Prem. And this right here, I might switch it up a little bit. I want to get Conte, but just in case I can't afford Conte, I'm going to assume that I can afford Sissoko. So that's kind of like the plan for my team. Uh, but keep in mind that I'm dropping a lot of FIFA points and this is not going to be a normal team that you see for a lot of people unless they're dropping like more than me. Um, and I'm really hoping that a thousand dollars will get me anywhere near this team because if I can't afford Mbappe or Neymar, I will be very sad. But overall, this is probably the team. Let's say that we can't afford Mbappe or Neymar. I might try and get Mane, Salah, go for like a Liverpool top like that. You know, some really good players that we can combine together. But overall, guys, this is the team that I will be making on my main account. And... I will show you guys the Road to Glory team on another video. I do plan on making a Road to Glory as well because I will have a uh, pay to win account for player reviews, etc. And then I'll have my Road to Glory that I will be uploading around three to four times a day uh, a week on the YouTube channel as well. But if you guys enjoyed this video, guys, with the player reviews, let me know in the comments down below. Make sure you guys do like the video for the YouTube algorithm and subscribe to the channel. I really do appreciate the support and I'm so excited to finally get into the FIFA 21 cycle. If you guys want to show me your teams, go over to my Twitter and at me with the teams. Uh, you know, post it underneath one of my posts, etc. And say you're the for YouTube. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. I really do appreciate it. And I'll see you guys tomorrow for another one of Weekend League or whatever we have for Champions Awards, etc. Peace out, my dudes. And I love you guys. Thank you guys for joining the channel.